JVL Integrated Servo Motors consists of a motor and a plug-in communication module. The control power and motor power are supplied separately. Mac 800 and Mac 1200 have a terminal for a single phase 230 volt input and the communication module has M12 connector for 24 volt DC. The separate control power allows the motor power to be off while still being able to monitor its position and status. Mac 800 and Mac 1200 are supplied by a single phase 230 volt AC or 115 volt AC if the jumper is added and the controller uses 24 volt DC. The motor terminals are accessed by removing the lid. Use a suitable three wire cable and connect the 230 volt phase to L1, neutral to N, and earth to PE. To use Mac 800 or Mac 1200 for 115 volt, add a jumper according to the Mac manual. The M12 five pin control power connector is unified on all JVL motors, modules, and M12 power cables. The wires also share the same color coding. Connect both the brown and white to 24 volt DC control power plus. Connect both the blue and gray to ground. Connect the black wire to 24 volt DC control voltage. Note that the black wire on specific modules is supply voltage for IOs or unused. Confirm AC power is off before connecting motor power. Connect the control power cable. Switch on your power supply and AC power. Depending on the module you're using, you'll see the LED turn on. If the module you're using does not have an LED, a cable with an LED in the connector is available. For commissioning and programming, use JVL's MacTalk software or a supported PLC. With MacTalk, you can do fast test movements and use the scope function to perform diagnostics and optimization. This was a quick Connection guide for an in-depth information, please read the manual. To learn more about JVL Intelligent Motors and to learn how to program the MacTalk software, I recommend watching some of the many JVL webinars. If you found the video useful, please like and subscribe. Your comments are also very welcome.